What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Fire Red walkthrough. Okay, so in our last episode, we went through the Victory Road, kicked some butt right there, got a few experience points, and now it is time for us to go into the Pokemon League. The only man that's ever believed in us is right here, he's like, yo, champion of making, at the Pokemon League, you will face the Elite Four all in a row. If you lose, you will have to start all over again. This is it. Go for it. Well pretty much it. That's all the encouragement he needs. Now, off screen, I did sell all, and I mean all my full heals and I believe hyper potions just to buy only full restores, because what's the need of getting all these, uh, what, what, what's, what's the point of getting, uh, separate things if one thing can do everything for, for everything? If you know what I mean, I know. I don't know how to speak. Let's talk to this girl, and she's like, from here on, you'll face the Elite Four one by one. If you win, a door opens to the next trainer. Good luck. Alrighty. Well, hello there. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. I've been looking. I've been looking forward towards you. And well, welcome to the Pokemon League. I am Lorelei of the Elite Four. No one can best me when it comes to icy Pokemon. Freezing moves are powerful. Your Pokemon will be at my mercy when they try. They are frozen solid. <laughs> are you ready? Yes, I am. Yes, I love this song. So, oh, here we go, guys. Very first battle against an Elite Four trainer, and that is, mm, 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 Elite Four Loyalai. One of my favorite ones. Mm. And here she's going to be coming out with a level 52 Dugong. Now, do you see why I, have, I prepared? Yes, these Pokemon are going to be stacked. And I believe... Yeah, the whole Elite Four right here is going to is, they're, they're, they're going to definitely have four, five Pokemon with them. It won't be until, like, the next time you battle them that, yeah, <laughs> they will have six. And six Pokemon with, like, some pretty good moves and all that crud. So just be aware of that right there, guys. And, well, look at this. Thunderbolt for the win again. And it nearly defeats this Pokemon. So let's go with an Iron Tail right here. And, yes... Just as effective. Say goodbye to Dugong. And, well, here she's coming out with a Cloyster. We're going to continue on right here, guys. Now we're going to have to take some risk. Because Cloyster is very defensive. Let's go with a Thunder Attack. Look at this. Mmm. Say goodbye. Cloyster, you have been eliminated. So, Shocker, kicking some butt, taking some names. Yes, getting some experience points and all that stuff. And here comes a Slowbro, a very, very, very defensive Pokemon. We're going to try this again. Thunder Attack for the win. And, well, you could say that I could use uh, Rain Dance right here. But it's a double-edged sword. The majority of her Pokemon no Water-type attacks. Yeah, that will actually mess me up. Like using a Pokemon such as Lapras. Lapras is a very, very powerful Pokemon. And wow, we missed. And here comes an Ice Beam attack. This won't fare well. Lapras, of course, is one of her strongest Pokemon. And come on, Shocker. Seriously? Here comes a Surf attack. And we got one last chance right here. And wow, Shocker. Seriously? Wow. Okay, so... Yeah. We got one more person, or we got an opponent right here. So let's go, uh, you know what? Let's go with Tornado. I know what you're thinking. This is probably the worst move that you can do. But we're going to try and physically hurt this Pokemon right here. And there we go. This beefy Pokemon is getting, uh, well. <laughs> yeah, look at that. Ice Beam attack really messes it, messing us up. So we're going to try this one last time. Drill Peg, just chop this Pokemon down. That's what we're doing. And yes, we're chopping everything. We're chopping on everything on this Pokemon. And well, there goes Tornado. OK. So let's go with Leonardo right here. I do have a move specifically for this Pokemon. And well, out of nowhere, Lapras is healing up with a Citrus Berry, so it knows what my combination is going to be. So let's go straight for a Seismic Toss. This is based off the Pokemon's weight. And, well, Lapras is a pretty big, big Pokemon right here. So here comes a Body Slam. Thankfully, we didn't get paralyzed. And look at this. This has become a war. Okay. Alrighty, Lapras. You don't like me, and I don't like you, but guess what? I'm going to win. 
I'm here to win, baby. Well, at least one of us has to win. So here we go again, Seismic Toss. And, well, we're definitely chopping this Pokemon down. And here we go, the King of Paralysis lives on still. Let's go, Leonardo. And here comes another Body Slam attack. And yes, we are not paralyzed. So here we go again. One more seismic toss, hopefully for the win. And there goes Lapras. That's right. Who would have thought that its weight would be its downfall? Here comes Jinx. So we are in the safe right here. Let's go with Big Booty Butkus. Alrighty. Okay. So here it is, Big Booty Butkus. Going up against Jinx herself. And yes, we are intimidating you. Let's go! Flamethrower attack. That's right. We're taking you out. Look at that. Oh, nearly takes him out! And here comes the lovely kiss of doom. And this will put our Pokemon to sleep. And I'm hearing you. I'm hearing you, subscriber, who mentioned this to me. I'm going to use it because, well, you had a big cow on it. But here it is, Pokefloop. And there we go. That's right. For whoever commented on this about me using items rather than a Poke Flute, there you go. We woke up Budkiss. Here comes the Ice Punch. And that right there is not very effective. So let's go with the Extreme Speed because I don't want the I don't want this Pokemon trainer trying anything dumb or anything like that. So Extreme Speed for the win. There you go. Okay, alrighty. So we have defeated our girlfriend, Lorelai. I am so sorry for doing this to you, but yes, we have defeated you. You're better than I thought. Go on ahead. You only got a taste of the Pokemon League's power. Yes, we have. Okay, so... Let's go right ahead and revive some Pokemon. And obviously, I didn't use any of the, uh... Of the, or I didn't use the rare candy that I had in the last episode. Should probably get a... Should probably do that right now. So let's go ahead and revive these two Pokemon. And let's see, where oh where are we? Full restores. We got 25 of those little suckers. So let's go ahead and speed this up a little. There we go. And there we go. Okay, so the next trainer is going to be Bruno. And I'm gonna start off with Leonardo right here, because I think he yeah, he comes out with an onyx. So here we are. There it is. Look at this. A lot of rocks. I am Bruno of the Elite Four. Through rigorous training, people and Pokemon can become stronger without a limit. I've lived and trained with my fighting Pokemon, and that will never change. Draven, we will grind you down with our superior power. <laughs> okay, I love this song right here, guys. Okay, so, round two fight and here we're taking on Bruno of the Elite Four and this guy yeah he's coming out with his onyx I'm prepared let's go surf attack for the win and that right there takes out the onyx bye bye okay alrighty so onyx is not happy about that shocker everybody getting some experience points and this is the part where tornado shines okay it's time this is what, yeah, this is what Tornado has been waiting for. Just to destroy everybody, let's go with a Drill Peck attack right here. There we go. Drill Peck. Does it sting. Say goodbye to Hitmonchan. Mm-hmm. There we go. Okay. Shocker. Grows to level 57. And, well, here he comes out with a Machamp. This guy is scary good because it does have water, or it does have a flying coverage with, uh, what was it called? Stone Edge, I believe. And here we go, Drill Pack. And that nearly defeats Monchamp. And here, oh, actually, no, it's not. It's not that, it's Rock Tomb. Thinking too far ahead, and well, with that hit, wow. And it slows us down, holy crud. So, let's see. Runo could be a champ and uh, heal him up, but this Pokemon's already healed up. And here comes a Drill Pack attack. That's right, we're faster than you. So there goes Machamp. Yeah, Tornado, look at this! You're winning, homeboy. And he's gonna be coming out with a him only. Let's go right ahead and do this. All right, Tornado, let's go. And the Brick Break attack, yes, hits us. 
And there goes Tornado. Okay, so let's go for Smoke. Okay, Smoke. How's it going for Psychic Attack right here? And there you go. Hitmonlee survives that. And here comes a Foresight. If you guys don't know, if Fighting type Pokemon use Foresight, it will be capable to hit you in the next turn. So just be aware of that. And well, there we go. Psychic Attack for the win. And Hitmonlee is happy no more. Look at that. Okay. And well, he's going to be coming out with an Onyx. Let's go straight for Leonardo yet again. Let's go. Alrighty, Leonardo, how's it going? Been a while. Let's get it. Let's go with the Surf Attack right here. And... Well, let's see. There we go. Super effective. And Leonardo gaining points. And Bruno has been defeated. He's wondering how he could lose. Well, you... Yeah, your team's pretty easy to beat. Don't know why you... Well, why you're here, but... It is what it is. Okay, so let's go right ahead and take away that experience share from Shocker. And let's go ahead and start reviving Pokemon. So let's give this to... Let's give this to Budkiss, because I have a feeling that we're going we're gonna to need him eventually. And again, a revive. That's always nice. There we go. And go back right here to full restore. And actually, let me take a look at something right here. He's close to... Okay. I think I have an idea who I'm going to give this uh, this rare candy to. We just need to wait a while. So, the next challenge is going to be against... Yeah, it's going to be against a, a really screwed up... Yeah, it's going to be a screwed up match. So, we're going to be going into the next match right here. And it sounds pretty weird. Holy crud. Oh my god, Lavender Town, I hate you. I am Agatha of the Elite Four. I hear Oak's taken a lot of interest in you, child. That old dove was once tough and handsome. But that was decades ago. He's a shadow of his former self. Now he wants to fiddle with his Pokedex. He's wrong, Pokemon are for battling. Draven, I'll show you how a real trainer battles. Okay. Alrighty. You guys already know what this means. I love this song. Okay, so here it is, round three, going up against Agatha. And she, yeah, she's a ghost type trainer. Emphasis on just like two ghosts. So here we go, we're going up against ghost against ghost. Let's go with the psychic attack right here. And hopefully that defeats it, maybe, I don't know. And yes, it does. Whew, okay, alrighty. There goes Gengar, and Smoke nearly grows to level 54, and here comes a Golbat. So, we're going to be smart about this, and we're going to go with Smasher. We do have a Pokemon, uh, we do have uh, a move ready for this guy right here. Name of the game, try not to waste the moves. So let's go with the Rock Slide, and here comes the Air Cutter. And that right there hits us good, but here comes the Rock Slide. And that right there hits it pretty good too. So let's go, holy crud, here comes a Confuse Ray. Yeah, that's definitely not happy. Yeah, we're not we're not in a happy mood right now. So here we go, Smasher, let's go, come on. And here comes the Rock Slide. And that right there takes out Golbat. Okay, alrighty. So that's another win for us right there, Budkiss. Get some experience points, and here comes Haunter. Haunter is going to be difficult, so let's go with Big Booty Budkiss right here. What I'm trying to do with this one is I'm going to go with a special attack. That usually works. Probably, I don't even know. So let's go right ahead and go with a flamethrower attack right here. And come on. Go with Arceus. And well, it has been born or burned, and well, look at that. Hypnosis hits us. That still won't save you, maybe, I don't know. You are burned, but she is more than likely going to heal you, so let's see. Again, shout out to the person who uh, called me out on this. I'm going to I'm going to use the pokey flute. There you go. See? Happy. I sure am. <laughs> okay, so we heard the pokey flute and Agatha uses a full restore on her haunter, so 
We're back to square one right here. And, well, let's go straight for a flamethrower attack. Flamethrower. Nearly does it again with the hypnosis. Okay, so we're going to have to screw with this again. There we go. And flamethrower again. Okay, so there we go. You see? Draven knows. He learns. He just, you know, he's too lazy right now. And Budkiss. Get some points. And we're going to be going up against an Arbok right here. So let's go back to Smasher. And, well. Come on, Arbok. Bring it on. Okay, so our physical attack has gone down, but we do have Earthquake. This move, oh yes, as powerful as it is, yes, almost takes him out right here. So here comes a Screech attack. Very valuable move now that I think about it. So here we go again, another Earthquake attack for the win. And there we go. Look at that, Arbok defeated. And, well, let's see, here comes a Gengar. Now, this is going to be uh, tricky because, well, we're going to be going up against another Gengar. It's probably going to be at level 60, I think. Nope, level 58. So what the deal is going to be right here is it's going to throw a Shadow Ball. I might just have to sacrifice this smoke right here. Yeah, I'm going to have to sacrifice smoke just to curse this Pokemon. Just because it's powerful, and, well, you are now cursed, my friend. Yes. So, thank you, Smoke, for doing your job. Let's go with Leonardo. Okay. Bring it. And you are afflicted by the curse, so, yes, thank you. Look at that. Okay, so let's set this one up. Are you serious? Okay. You know what? You know what? Let him beat me. Go ahead. Nightmare. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Do what you gotta do. <laughs> I'm asleep, but guess what? You're still afflicted by curse, so... Seriously, who loses? And, yes, we are locked in a nightmare. So, who's gonna really lose in this one? Here comes a sludge bomb. And, well... You're fast asleep. Yes, you're gonna be hit by, by a nightmare. And... Uh-huh. Okay, Citrus Berry will heal you, but guess what? You still got a curse on you, homeboy. And... Well, the nightmare is hitting us. Okay, so... You know what? Not the Poke Flute. We need to use a full restore, mainly because... Oh, there it is. Okay, so... <laughs> yeah, do what you gotta do, Agatha, but... <laughs> you're still afflicted by the curse. Look at that. You can't get rid of a curse. Gonna have to try and figure that one out. Either you can switch out your Pokemon, but... Okay, this is getting annoying. Alright, um... There we go, Poke Flute. And Rain Dance. There we go. Yeah, I'm trying to set this one up, but this Pokemon won't let me. So here comes a Rain Dance. And you're still afflicted by the Curse. And, wow, that nearly defeats him. So here we go, Surf Attack. That doesn't work. And here goes Surf for just one HP. <laughs> Okay, there we go, and we get some points, and that is how we do it. Oh my, you're something special, child. Yes, we are. Thank you, thank you very much. And, well, we win, and yes, she now sees why that old Duff sees in us and all that stuff. I have nothing else to say. Run along now, child. She's such a nice person after you get to know her. So, let's go right ahead and, well, let's go right ahead and heal up some Pokemon right here. Smoke, thank you for doing your job. Get a full restore. Another one on Smasher. And Leonardo. And let's see. Hmm. You know, this could have worked if you would have grown a level. But it looks like to me we're going to have to wait up on, on that for just a little bit. So let's go right ahead and take on the next challenge. And that is Lance. So here we are, guys. Going into the final battle of the Elite Four, before the champion and all that crud. Look at that. Door shut and everything. Here's Lance, aka Batman, and... Ah, I've heard about you, Draven. I lead the Elite Four. You can call me Lance, the Dragon Trainer. You know that dragons are mythical Pokemon. They're hard to catch and raise, but their powers are superior. They're virtually indestructible. There's no being clever with them. 
Eh, well, check with this a few years later. Fairy types have something to say about that. Well, are you ready to lose? Your league challenge ends with me, Draven. Yeah. I don't know about that, guys. So, you guys already know what I'm going to say. This is going to be fun. I love this song. Alrighty, here we are, guys. Taking on Pokemon Batman himself, Lance, and he is coming out with a Gyarados. This guy is no joke because he does use dragon-like Pokemon, not dragon Pokemon yet. And we're going to go with a thunder attack right here because, well, quad damage to Gyarados himself. And look at this. Yes, that's how you do it. Okay, so that's one down. Many more to go. Butkus grows to level 53. And, well, he's going to be coming out with a Dragonair. So let's go with uh, Leonardo right here. Cool thing about this Pokemon, we do have Ice Beam. We did buy that for a lot of <laughs> a lot of coins. So let's go straight for the Ice Beam. Now, I remember playing Pokemon Red, Blue, and Yellow and not knowing what the weakness for Dragon-type Pokemon was until it said Dragon-type Pokemon. And I was like... Okay, so there was only one move that was Dragon at the time, and it wasn't even super effective. How messed up was that? And then, you know, the other part was Ice-type Pokemon, and, I, it, you know, years later, it just came, you know, it made sense. Oh, you know, Dragon-type Pokemon are kind of like, you know, dinosaurs or some stuff. You know, they are afraid of ice. War or cold-blooded creatures, I believe. Yeah. So there we go. We have defeated Dragonair. And here comes another Dragonair. Now remember, Lance does have two Dragonairs plus a Dragonite. Each Dragonair has some kind of move that will mess with you. That'll be, a, you know, a Thunder Wave, Fire Blast, and all that stuff. This guy right here, of course, has a Thunder Wave. Yeah, why are you being so lame, man? Let's go Seismic Toss, and here comes an Outrage Attack. And that will hit us pretty hard right there. So here comes a Seismic Toss for the win. That's right, Dragonair. How you feel? How's it feel to, to fail right here? And look at this. Leonardo grows to level 58. And here comes a Dragonite. So I got the Pokemon ready for you. Let's go with Smoke. Alrighty. Smoke. You know what to do. Here comes Lance and his Dragonite at level 60. And, well, we're going to try and use a Curse Attack right here because this will actually help us with Dragonite. There is no cure for any kind of, uh, well, for Curse, unless you want to switch him out. And here comes the Safeguard. So, let's go right ahead. Let's go right ahead and take a chance. Let's go with Double Team. Because if this actually works, we can actually beat the next, uh, the next trainer, or the next, uh, what was it called, uh, the next Pokemon in. Well, that doesn't work right there. Okay. So, let's go... Let's go with it, Leonardo. All right, Leonardo. And here comes the Afflicted with Curse. Okay, so if we get a chance right here, let's the best chance. Here comes an Outrage attack, and that will hit us pretty hard. Here comes the Ice Beam attack, and this should defeat the Dragonite. Yes, it does. Throwing out that P sign. There we go. Okay, so everybody's getting points right here. And Aerodactyl is coming up next. Now, this Pokemon is super fast. Probably one of the fastest in all of Pokemon. So this is a chance for us to actually, you know, use a full restore. Because, yeah, it is very fast. We, we're going to need to beat this Pokemon. So here comes its Wing Attack. And, well, let's go with the Rain Dance. And an Ancient Power. Like, like I said, this Pokemon's fast. Like, faster than fast. And here, that was a critical hit. So here we go, Rain Dance. And, well, you are no longer protected by Safeguard, so that probably would have been something right there. So let's go Surf Attack. Wing Attack, let's see if that hits as hard. And no, it doesn't. So here comes Surf Attack. And it's going to be buffed up just a little bit by that Rain Dance. And look at that. Throwing out that piece on, guys. Oh, yes. Oh, my God. And Lance has defeated. He's like, that's it. I hate to admit it, but you are a Pokemon master. I've always been a Pokemon master. It's just... <laughs> yeah. I still can't believe my dragons lost to you, Draven. You are now the Pokemon League champion. 
four. You would have been, but you have one more challenge left. There is one more trainer to face. His name is Gary. He beat the Elite Four before you. He is the real Pokemon League champion. You wanna bet, Batman? Okay, so let's go ahead and heal up our Pokemon. And, oh yeah, forgot about that. Um, Let's see, let's see. Let's go with a revive right here. No need to waste our, our max revive. There we go, and right here. And, well, you know what? We're gonna need that charcoal. So let's go ahead and give that to Budkiss. Give the experience share to Smoke because, you know, it's done its job. And, uh, let's see, Amulet Coin. Let's give it the Shocker. And this rare candy. Actually, let's first check to see what we got because if I got a chance to level up one more time... Yeah, let's go ahead and give it to Leonardo right here. I was gonna give it to Smoke, but it looks like to me that, you know, it fainting twice is gonna not do anything. Okay. Let's see. Kinda need to check up on something right here because... Okay, so Thunder has four points. Let's go right ahead and use one more Ether on Thunder just in case. Because, uh, yeah, Gary's gonna start trying to, to mess with us right here. Okay, so let's go right ahead and take care of business right here. Look at this guy all smug and everything, and he's gonna be like, Hey, Draven. I was looking forward to seeing you, Draven. My rival should, should be strong and, and keep me sharp. While working on my Pokedex, I looked all over for Pokemon, and not only that, I assembled teams that would be any Pokemon type. And now, I'm the Pokemon League Champion. Draven, do you know what that means? I, I do, but I do know what's going to happen next, and it's going to be bad for you. I'll tell you, I am the most powerful trainer in the world. You want to bet? Okay. It's time. So, here is the Pokemon League Championship, and we are taking on Champion Gary. Having a team of six, starting off with a Pidgeot, and we're going to go with the Thunder because, well, yes. We gotta come up with. Uh, we gotta start off with a bang right here. And Thunder hits its opponent, and there goes Pidgeot. That's right. Burnt chicken. Burnt chicken. And well, we get more points. And Smoke finally grows to level 54, like it should have. And he's gonna be coming out with a right on. So let's go with Leonardo. Alrighty. Leonardo, how's it going? It's been cool. Time to defeat this guy. He has a level 59. Level 59 right, right on, and well, we're gonna go straight for a Surf Attack. And this... takes out right on. All right, let's go. And well, let's see. He's gonna be coming out with a Venusaur, so let's go straight for Tornado. Mainly because... there is a little something I wanna do with Tornado in this one. Level 63, let's go with Agility. This will sharpen up our, our agility a little bit by two points. And here comes a growth attack. So, I'm thinking about what happens afterwards. Let's go with a drill peck. And this will almost beat Venusaur. And here comes another growth attack right here. Now, this is spe like this is upping its special attack, so we better hit it real quickly. And here comes its citrus berry. So, let's go right ahead and get it with another drill peg. Hopefully this will defeat it. And just like that, Venusaur has been defeated by Tornado. That's right, Tornado. Assert your authority on these people. And here comes Alakazam. This is the Pokemon I've been looking for. Alakazam is usually fast. And since the agility is here, we're going to physically hit it with drill peg. This will take out Alakazam with a crit. That's right, flipping you off, Gary. I am superior to you in every friggin' way. Here comes Gyarados. Let's go, Shocker. Hey, come on. Go ahead and use a Rain Dance. Make my day. So here comes Gyarados. And of course, he's gonna try and lower our, our physical attack, but guess what? Thunder attack, crap baskets. <laughs> and there is the Hydro Pump. And of course, we're gonna be missing Thunder attack, god dang it. Okay, so. Shouldn't have gotten cocky right there. So we're gonna go with Smoke. All right, Smoke. Time to do your thing. Curse attack. That's right. We don't mess around with this one right here. That's right, we're gonna mess you up. 
And well, here comes a thrash attack. It's not gonna it's not gonna affect me, homeboy. So here comes that curse. And this right here will open up a psychic attack. And uh, whichever way you see it, this guy's gonna try and hit me with a hydro pup, but hey, we're gonna beat you with a curse. And just like that, Smoke has been defeated. And well, now we're gonna have to go straight to uh, Tornado. Alright. That's right, Tornado. You got an easy opening right here, so let's go with a drill pack. This will obviously defeat Gyarados. That's right, Tornado becoming the MVP right here. And here comes Arcanine. Let's go right ahead and finish him off with Leonardo. Oh, yes. Okay. What up? Level 61 Arcanine. I didn't even get to use mine. Let's lower its attack right here. Here comes an extreme speed. Seriously, why do you have to go and do that? I don't know. But here comes the rain dance. So any kind of fire attack is not going to work for him. And yes. That's right. It's raining. It's pouring. The old man is snoring. Gary bumped his head. I don't know. I, I won't say he got dead. I'm just saying it. And well, the extreme speed hits it pretty hard. But here comes Surf Attack. And this one will have defeated Arcanine. Gary, I am throwing out a whole bunch of middle fingers. A bag of middle fingers. Look at that. No! That can't be! You beat me at my best! After all that work to become the Pokemon League champ. My reign is over already? It's not fair. Throwing out the biggest bags of middle fingers. Why? Why did I lose? I never made any mistakes of raising my Pokemon. Darn it! You're the new Pokemon League champion. Although I don't like to admit it. <laughs> admit it because uh, I own you. I own you. Like the Green Bay Packers and Aaron Rodgers, I own you, Chicago. Anywho, here's Oak, and he's going to be like, Draven! Look at this. So, you won! Sincerely, congratulations! You're the new Pokemon League champion. You've grown up so much since you uh, first left with Squirtle at work uh, to work on the Pokedex. Draven, you've come of age. Gary, I am dis disappointed in you. Here's a bag of middle fingers. Da-da-da-da-da, da-da-da-da-da. Yes, bag of middle fingers. You suck. Gary, I am disappointed in you. You will never be champ again. Draven, my underling, you understand your victory was not just your own doing. The bond of your share, uh, the bond you share with your Pokemon is marvelous. Draven, come with me. Flipping you off, Gary. I'm flipping you off. <laughs> yes, I am a poor sport sometimes, guys. I really am. Anywho, here's Oak. He's like, hmm. Congratulations, Draven. This floor is the Pokemon Hall of Fame. Pokemon League champions are honored in, uh, for their exploits here. Their Pokemon are also recorded in the Hall of Fame. Draven, you have worked hard to become the new Pokemon League champion. Congratulations, Draven. You and your Pokemon are now Hall of Famers. Yes. Throwing out that peace sign, guys. Mm-hmm. Throwing out a big bag of middle fingers to Gary. Anywho, here it is, guys. Look at this. Hall of Famers, Shocker the Jolteon, Smoke Gengar, Big Booty Bookkiss, Smasher, Tornado, and Leonardo. That's right, guys. They're finally Hall of Famers after all these times of, like, after, after all these, this time of service on some of these Pokemon. They're finally Pokemon League champs after 25 episodes. Yes. Oh, yeah. Okay, so League Champion, congratulations. Ah, it feels good to be the champion. And <laughs> he's so salty, he hates my guts. And yeah, I'm the grandchild that you wish I had, you wish you had. Anywho. Whew, okay, alrighty. So, let's move on to the next monologue right here, guys. Anywho. 25 episodes, guys. 25 friggin' episodes, and we finally did it right here. So, I got a few things to talk about before we end off right here, guys. So, you guys already know that I am planning on putting in the teams from Leaf Green, Fire Red, all the way to Emerald, so we can go into the Battle Frontier. When that will happen, I do not know. We are still continuing our Pokemon Emerald walkthrough right here. 
I just want to say thank you guys for just being supportive and being as patient as you can be. I know that you know every single day now you've been getting a walkthrough video, and it's a it's it's something new. It's something that you know you haven't seen in ever. And I'm actually happy uh, for doing this. Now again, I don't do this for you know just to gain all this money and all that stuff. I do this as a hobby, an escape. Because yes, Draven does have a huge schedule that he has to uphold, and this right here is his escape. Um. Speaking of which, many of you guys already noticed on my channel that I have two other channels, Pokemon Journeys HD and House of Draven. Okay, Pokemon Journeys HD has now been converted into a hack games only a channel, so please go ahead and check that out, subscribe, I would like to get that channel up to a thousand subscribers, that way we can just, you know, get more views on it. Right now, you guys probably already noticed, I've been playing Pokemon GS Chronicles alongside the hack videos that I've I done in back in 2020 so check that out if you guys want to check out some different kind of content right there how's a Draven channel is specifically for like strategic stuff you know how to where to find these kinds of stuff if you guys have any suggestion on any suggestions on what I should do or should I put on my house Draven channel by all means comment down below I'm open to anybody's comments about what I should do on the content and all that stuff Wow, that was a mouthful. Anywho, um, let's see. Is there anything else? No, there's a, there, there, there's nothing else, guys. Yes, I, I will continue doing remakes and all that stuff. The next remake after this walkthrough right here is going to be Pokemon Heart Gold. I already played it, but guess what? We're restarting it because you guys want it. And it's going to be around the same thing as this, where we're going to be playing five episodes a day and all that stuff, or five episodes a week. And, uh... Yeah, hopefully it's better than the last one. Now, the reason why we're we're restarting, it's because didn't necessarily like how I just went missing a few months here and there and all that stuff. Kind of want to keep it consistent now that we're, we're getting a little traction here on my channel. So that is exactly what we're going to be doing. Now, some of you guys suggested Pokemon, Let's Go Eevee and Pikachu. We'll be doing that later on, guys. It's just I kind of want to get to one... Like, you know, one walkthrough after another, and Heart Gold is something that you guys have been wanting, wanting back on my channel for quite some time. So, that's what we're going to do. Other than that, guys, thank you guys for watching again. Thank you guys for being patient. Next week, we will be back here in Pokemon Fire Red, and we will be trying to complete this whole walkthrough. So, thank you guys again for watching. I'll see you guys next time.